9th chapter differentiation this chapter belongs to mathematics 1b part 3 last part completed impounded four marks problem by using first principle of derivative today discuss some more problems by using first principle what is the first problem f of x equal to e power x first you can write first principle formula what is the formula first principle f dash x is equal to limit h tends to 0 f of x plus h to minus f of x all by h this one is the formula of first principle in this first principle formula f of x value is given f of x value is given that is e power x f of x plus h you can find f of x plus h f of x plus h is equal to e power in place of h you can write x you can write x plus h that's why here e power x plus h is there this e power x plus h you can write e power x into e power h why because you can write this way here formula is there basis are equal power should be added here e, e basis are equal power should be added you get similar answer that's why these two values this value and this value two values of student equation what one in class f dash x is equal to limit x tends to zero e power e power x plus x value e power x into e power x minus e power x all by h understood or not students after that in this two term you can come which one is common in this two term e power x is common remaining e power x minus 1 all by h here e power x is constant why because here limit having only h terms having limit that's why e power x is common remaining limit h tends to 0 e power x minus 1 by h you know that the limits chapter limits chapter you know that this formula what is that formula limit x tends to 0 e power x minus 1 by x value is 1 this is the formula by using limits chapter in this formula x value is h h h h this is also you can write to 1 that's why you can write e power x this total value equal to 1 e power x is 1 that's why you can write e power x therefore derivative of derivative of f of x is equal to e power x is e power x very easy formula e power x derivative is e power x that is a very easy formula and a very easy proof next problem is f of x is equal to a power x once again you can write first principle formula f dash x is equal to limit x tends to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x by h this one is the first principle formula in this first principle formula you can write equation 1 you know that f of x value f of x value is a power x f of x value is a power x f of x plus h f of x plus h value is a power x plus h that a power x plus h you can write a power x into a power x that means bases are equal power should be added this value substituted in the equation for you get what one implies f dash x is equal to limit x tends to zero you know that f of x plus h value a power x into a power x minus f of x value a power x all by h in this two term which one is common a power x is common limit x tends to zero a power x is common a power x minus one by h in this two term a power x is common a power x minus one by h here a power x can be common constant why because function in terms of h a power x is the constant that's why you can write a power x into limit x tends to 0 a power x minus 1 by h you get the main you know that the limit set continuity chapter limit x tends to 0 a power x minus 1 by x is equal to log a base e this formula is there which chapter is there limit and continuity chapter limit x tends to 0 a power x minus 1 by x value is there that is log a base e 
you can write that formula here f dash x is equal to a power x you can write similar this total value observe that that model or not here x is there x is there x is there you can write log a base c here h h h that value also you can write log a base c therefore derivative of therefore derivative of your form x is equal to a power x is f dash x is equal to a power x into log a base c. This is the derivative of a power x. What is the derivative of a power x? Derivative of a power x is a power x. Derivative of a power x is a power x into log a base c or a power x into log a. These two formulas are very very useful and very very important. This proofs by using first principle also be important in IV examination. Next problem is f of x is equal to log x base c. Here e power x exponent form completed. a power x also be exponent. Exponent derivatives two completed. e power x derivative e power x. a power x derivative is a power x. Next problem by using logarithmic function. That is first one is log x. In this log x first we can write a First principle of derivative. What is that first principle? F dash x is equal to limit x tends to zero. F of x plus h minus f of x whole by h. This one is the formula of first principle of derivative. Which derivative? First principle of derivative. In this formula, you can write f of x is equal to log x base c. You know that f of x and log x base c. After that, you can find f of x plus h. f of x plus h nothing but in place of x you can write x plus h. That's why f of x plus h is equal to log of log of in place of x you can write x plus h base g. These two values substituted in equation 1 in place of f of x and f of x plus h. We can write 1 in place f dash x is equal to limit x tends to 0. You know that f of x plus h value. What is that? Log of x plus h base e minus you know that f of x value f of x value is log x base e all by h you know that log a log a minus log b what is that formula log a minus log b log a by b what is that formula of log a minus log b log a minus log b formula is log a by b you can write that formula f dash x is equal to Limit h tends to 0 log a minus log b. What is the formula? Log of a by b minus b x plus h by b whole by h. Understood? Or not? Log of a by b a by x plus h by x whole by h. After that, you can write f dash x is equal to limit h tends to 0. Here you can write log of you can write log of x by x, x by x plus h by x over by x. Understood or not? Understood or not? First of all, see here x plus h by x is there. Here numerator separated x by x plus h by x over by h over by h. You can write sorry here over by h. You can write say. Here, x, x to cancel, limit x tends to 0, log of 1 plus h by x by h, 1 plus h by x by h. You know that, limit x tends to 0, log of 1 plus a x by x is equal to a. This formula is, which chapter is there? Eighth chapter in mathematics one will limit and continuity. In that chapter, this formula is standard limit formula. What is the formula? Limit x tends to zero log of one plus a x by x equal to a. Here x is there. Here x is there. Here x is there. You can write in place of a any value. That value is the answer. That's why you can write this one is x tends is equal to limit x tends to zero log of 1 plus 
1 by x into x by h. See students, here h is there, here also b h is there, here also b h is there, x x x is there. Remaining, what is the value of a? Here a is for constant. Here this limit in terms of h, h having only functions, remaining all variables are constants. That's why here in place of a is what here? 1 by x. In this formula, we can write this value is 1 by x. This value is what here? 1 by x by using this formula. Understood? Here a value is what here? 1 by x. That is answer. Therefore, derivative of f of x is equal to log x base d is f dash x is equal to 1 by x. This is a very very useful and important. This 3, the derivative of a power x is a power x. Derivative of a power x is a power x into log a base d. Derivative of log x is 1 by x. This proof are very very useful and very very important in IP examination. Especially this, this talk. Here this formula is must and should using this uh, limits and continuity formula. You get easily coming to the answer total. Therefore, the derivative of log x is uh, 1 by x. This uh, today class explained exponent function derivatives and logarithmic function derivative. Okay, students.